Welcome back to Ecuador, the center of the world. Okay, here are the facts, plain and simple. We began the night with 80 beautiful women. Inexplicably, we asked 65 of them to leave. The field is now narrowed down to 15, and then we went to 10. And now, only five of these young ladies will have a chance to be an instant celebrity and a role model for women all over the world. Judges, we thank you for your votes. Now, Daisy, in this moment for these girls, this is incredible. I it, know. It's tense, and if we don't think about it, we'll both be all right. I know, I'm not all right. Okay, here we go. Right now, here are the top five in random order. We begin with Paraguay. Next, USA. And Puerto Rico. Next, Australia. And finally, Trinidad and Tobago. of Miss Universe 2004, congratulations. Okay, when we come back, we're taking the competition to the point of no return. Only the final question remains. Oh, the final question, where the wheels can come off. Someone's life is about to change when we return here at Miss Universe 2004, live in Quito, Ecuador on NBC. competition here at Miss Universe 2004. And to many, this is considered the hardest part of the night. I mean, they're under pressure. La pregunta final, it's the final question. We live for this moment. <laughs> all right, during the week, we met with all 80 women and we asked each one to make a final question. Earlier, we pulled the questions written by the top five and the current Miss Universe, Amelia Vega. So that means the final question is coming from someone else right here on this stage. 